So a couple of years ago, I got to meet John Asheroff, and not just meet the guy, but actually visit him in his home just outside San Diego. Now, this is that famous house that, if you've been following John, you may have heard him talk about on Larry King Live and The Secret and other shows he's appeared on. What's interesting is not so much the house, but how he was able to attract that house. See, as the story goes, John is a big believer in the power of the human mind to draw to you those realities and ideas and visions that you put out. So he practices this thing called vision boards. And when John was younger, he used to create vision boards with beautiful objects that he wanted in his life. What happened was, a few years back, John was living in this gorgeous home, the one you're going to see me and John tour in this video. And he was moving boxes around the house, and he had taken some boxes from one room and was moving these old boxes to his attic or something. And his kid went and said, Dad, what's in this box? And so John said, oh, those are my vision boards. So the kid said, show me. So John opened up this box, took out vision board after vision board, and was just showing his son his vision boards and explaining the various gorgeous pictures of homes, houses, trips, adventure that he had stuck on these boards. And then John noticed something really interesting. On one of his old vision boards was the exact home he was living in right now. So out of like maybe 20 million something homes in America, he happened to be living in the one home whose picture he had stuck on his vision board years ago and then forgotten about. And so this story was just fascinating. And this story is what got John in the movie The Secret. And it's also a testament to just what the human mind can do when you put an idea out there or an ideal that you want to attract into your life. Check out the video and hear John explain the story and how it came about. So a lot of people ask me about you know, the movie The Secret and the vision board and is it really true and was it the real house and why didn't I know that I bought my dream home? Well, as you can tell, you know, when you drive down the driveway, the drive is a pretty long driveway and it's a flat front, um, and I never had a picture of the front of the house, mm. right? The picture that I was visualizing was always from the back looking huh. at the house. I never, I didn't have any cells of recognition in my own brain. And right over here is where the boxes were that I talk about in the movie. So they were against this door after we moved in. And my son came, it was 2000, and he was sitting on the boxes outside my or right out here, it was banging on the boxes, and it was like the second or third day we were here. I said, Daddy, what's in the box? I said, they're my vision boards. And he said, well, what's a vision board? I said, well, when I have a goal that I want to achieve, I cut a picture out of it and I put it up on the board. And so he said, well, can I see it? And so I said, sure. So cut open the boxes and pulled out the first board, and there's a car and some nice stuff that I wanted to achieve. And he's getting all excited. He says, what's, what's in the rest of the, the box? And what's on the rest of the boards? And I pull out the second board, and right smack in the middle of the board was a picture of this house. And so, come on in. <laughs> that is the picture from the movie The Secret. This is my vision board and wall. This is my achieved board up here. But that is why oh I God. never knew yeah. that I bought my dream home. I didn't have a picture here because when you drive up the driveway, as you can tell, it doesn't look anything like that. Wow. And that's the inside story wow. of how I didn't wow. know that I bought my dream home. Uh, it's because that's what it looks like. You can see we've redone some stuff, but um, I had no idea. Don't talk about it, but I live it. Yeah, you know, this I do. Is, you know, I live uh, live all the stuff that I talk about, right? So, John, that is an amazing well, story. So did you interesting is now that you know that now that we're ready, we I've had this up here for about two years now, mm -hmm. and now we're renovating that main floor. We're using a lot of the oh, same color yeah, schemes right. and everything that's in here. Yeah. <laughs> So anything that I want, I write down, I yeah. write, I get pictures of, and then I create the, the mental image, yeah. and the emotion, and then obviously the strategic plan mm -hmm. for achieving that as well. But it all starts with pictures, it all starts with an image for me. And this is something, Vision, that almost nobody knows about, and that's this group right over here. 
Now, this is a group, okay, of my virtual mastermind group. And so Isaac Newton, Stephen Hawking, Albert Einstein, a lot of times when I'm visualizing or I'm in meditation, I sit at the board table with my virtual mastermind mm -hmm. group mm -hmm. and ask them for what their thoughts are. And so each one of these individuals represents a part of my life, mm. right? And so they, in my opinion, were some of the best in the world ever of representing certain things, so whether it's philanthropy or kindness or ingenuity or manifestation. This is my virtual mastermind group. So. Mm. Wow, thank awesome. you so much for sharing yeah. that with us. There's a lot of energy mm -hmm. in this room. Yeah. A lot. It's I was on strong. my computer. Just keep watching. Wow. Wow. It's mm. so cool. Yeah.